Martial arts are about more than just fighting. They encompass a philosophy that extends beyond the physical realm. They're about discipline, self-improvement, and pushing your limits. It's a journey of personal growth and self-discovery. At the core of martial arts mastery lies a secret weapon muscle memory. This is what separates a novice from a master. Muscle memory is your body's ability to remember movements. It's a form of procedural memory that allows you to perform tasks without conscious effort. It's like your brain has a built-in autopilot for physical actions. This autopilot is honed through countless hours of practice and repetition. Think about it. You don't have to consciously think about how to walk, ride a bike or tie your shoes. These actions have become second nature through repetition. Your muscles just know what to do. This is the essence of muscle memory. In martial arts, muscle memory is crucial for reacting instinctively in high pressure situations. It allows you to respond without hesitation. When the adrenaline's pumping, you don't have time to think about your next move. Every second counts and your body must act on its own. Your body needs to react automatically. This automatic response can be the difference between victory and defeat. That's where muscle memory comes in. It's the foundation upon which all martial arts techniques are built. By repeatedly practicing techniques, you're essentially programming your muscles to react a certain way. This programming is essential for mastery. The more you train, the more ingrained these movements become. Consistency and dedication are key. Eventually, they become second nature. This is the ultimate goal of martial arts training, to achieve a state where your body and mind are in perfect harmony. Repetition is key in martial arts training. It's the cornerstone of developing true skill and mastery. It's not about learning a thousand different techniques. Instead, it's about honing a select few until they become second nature. It's about mastering a few essential ones. These core techniques form the bedrock of your martial arts journey. Think about Bruce Lee's famous quote, I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once, but I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times. This highlights the importance of focused practice. He was talking about the power of repetition. Repeating the same move over and over ingrains it into your muscle memory. By drilling the same techniques over and over, you develop muscle memory, speed, and precision. These elements are crucial for effective martial arts. You also build confidence in your abilities. Confidence comes from knowing that you can rely on your skills when it matters most. When you know you can execute a technique perfectly, you're more likely to remain calm and focused under pressure. This mental clarity is essential in high-stress situations. Repetition can be tedious, but it's the only way to truly master martial art. The monotony of practice is what separates the novice from the expert. It's about building a solid foundation of fundamental techniques. These basics are the building blocks for more advanced moves. Once you have that foundation, you can start to improvise and adapt. Mastery allows for creativity and innovation in your practice. My own martial arts journey has been all about building that foundation. I've trained in Taekwondo, kickboxing, and Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu. Each discipline has its own unique techniques, but they all rely on the same principles of muscle memory and repetition. My training routine always includes a heavy dose of basic techniques. I drill punches, kicks, blocks, and footwork for hours on end. It's not always glamorous, but it's essential. By mastering the fundamentals, I'm building a solid base for more advanced techniques. I also focus on sparring, which is essential for developing timing, distance, and reflexes. Sparring allows you to test your techniques against a resisting opponent in a controlled environment. It's the ultimate test of your skills. There's a big difference between aesthetic focused training and functional martial arts practice. Some martial arts schools focus on flashy techniques and high flying kicks that might look impressive in a movie, but it's not always practical in a real life situation. Functional martial arts are about efficiency and effectiveness. It's about learning techniques that will actually work in a self-defense situation. That means focusing on simple, direct movements that can be executed quickly and powerfully. It's also about understanding the principles of leverage, timing, and distance. A smaller, weaker person can defeat a larger, stronger opponent if they know how to use these principles to their advantage. Section 5. The Power of Basics In a real fight, your fancy spinning kicks and flying elbows might not be that useful. You're more likely to rely on basic punches, kicks, and grappling techniques. That's why it's so important to master the fundamentals. Think about it. 
A straight punch, executed correctly, can be incredibly powerful. A well-timed leg kick can cripple an opponent, and a solid takedown can give you the upper hand in a grappling exchange. These basic techniques might not be as flashy as some of the more advanced moves, but they're the foundation of any good martial art. They're the techniques that you'll rely on when it matters most. Section 6. Age is just a number maintaining skill through consistency. One of the great things about martial arts is that it's a lifelong journey. It's not just about the physical prowess you develop, but also the mental and spiritual growth you experience along the way. You never stop learning and improving. Each day brings new challenges and opportunities to refine your skills. And while age might slow you down physically, it can also make you a more technical and strategic fighter. Experience and wisdom often compensate for the loss of youthful speed and strength. The key to maintaining your skills as you get older is consistency. Regular practice helps keep your body and mind sharp. You don't have to train as intensely as you did in your younger years, but you do need to stay active. Gentle, consistent training can be just as effective in maintaining your skills. Even practicing for an hour a few times a week can make a big difference. It's about quality, not just quantity. It's also important to listen to your body and adjust your training accordingly. Pushing too hard can lead to injuries, which can set you back. As you get older, you might need to focus more on technique and less on brute strength. Precision and control become your greatest allies. You might also need to incorporate more mobility and flexibility work into your routine. This can help prevent injuries and keep your body limber. Additionally, incorporating mindfulness practices such as meditation and breathing exercises can enhance your mental clarity and focus, which are crucial for martial arts. Sharing your knowledge and experience with younger practitioners can also be incredibly rewarding. It not only helps them grow, but also reinforces your own understanding and mastery of the art. Remember, martial arts is not just about physical ability. It's a holistic practice that encompasses mind, body and spirit. By maintaining consistency, you honor the art and continue to grow no matter your age. Section 7. The Mind-Body Connection – Training for Real-Life Scenarios Martial arts training isn't just about physical conditioning, it's also about mental discipline and awareness. In a real-life confrontation, your state of mind can be just as important as your physical abilities. That's why many martial arts schools incorporate meditation, breathing exercises, and other mindfulness practices into their training. These practices help you to develop focus, calmness, and emotional control. They also teach you to be aware of your surroundings and to anticipate potential threats. This kind of situational awareness can be invaluable in avoiding dangerous situations altogether. Section 8. Discipline and Dedication – The Keys to Long-Term Success Martial arts require discipline and dedication. There will be days when you don't feel like training. There will be times when you want to quit, but it's important to push through those tough moments. The rewards of martial arts training are well worth the effort. You'll get in the best shape of your life. You'll learn valuable self-defense skills, and you'll develop confidence, discipline, and mental toughness. But most of all, you'll embark on a journey of self-discovery. Martial arts have the power to transform you physically, mentally, and spiritually. Section 9. The Journey of Martial Arts A Lifelong Pursuit The journey of martial arts is a lifelong pursuit. There's always something new to learn, always room for improvement. It's about constantly challenging yourself and pushing your limits. It's also about finding joy in the process. Martial arts training should be challenging, but it should also be fun and rewarding. If you're not enjoying yourself, you're less likely to stick with it. So find a martial art that you're passionate about. Find a good instructor and commit to the journey. The rewards will be well worth it. Section 10. Finding your path. Exploring different styles and techniques. There are hundreds of different martial arts styles out there, each with its own unique philosophy and techniques. Some styles, like Taekwondo and Muay Thai, emphasize striking. Others, like Judo and Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu, focus on grappling. The best martial art for you will depend on your individual goals, interests, and body type. Some people prefer the fast-paced, high-flying techniques of Taekwondo. Others prefer the ground-fighting techniques of Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu. There's no right or wrong answer. 
The important thing is to find a style that you enjoy and that fits your needs. Don't be afraid to try out different schools and instructors until you find the right fit. Section 11. The Transformative Power of Martial Arts Martial arts have the power to transform your life. They can make you stronger, healthier, and more confident. They can teach you valuable self-defense skills and help you to develop discipline, focus, and mental toughness. But the benefits of martial arts go far beyond the physical. They can also help you to develop self-esteem, respect for yourself and others, and a sense of community. Martial arts are about more than just fighting. They're about self-improvement, personal growth, and becoming the best version of yourself. So if you're looking for a way to challenge yourself, learn new skills, and transform your life, give martial arts a try. You might just surprise yourself with what you're capable of.